apex uh, goodness. Um, every spark is boosted up. You want to smash like a crate opener or something? When our, when our particle effects guy, uh, Jeremy, started doing this stuff, uh, yeah, right, like everything sprays and bounces and collides, which I actually thought was a really cool, the coolest thing about um, uh, the apex particles was the fact that they collide against the geometry and then the video called this up and said, no, no, the coolest thing is the turbulence, be more turbulence in these things. So we did, so we did that. Um, Right, right. So there's lots of like crazy cool stuff that we that uh, that we've used. Um, you know, the sh shadows have always looked better because you guys always have the PCF shadows. It's horrible to get a graphics programmer up here in front of press because like I'm going to talk about all weird obscure things. Like I actually had that 3D effects card you were talking about. Um, for Quake, for Quake. Uh, right. What else? What else are we going to talk about? We, you guys want to do some? What, what, what powers have we got? Can you do Sarah? Can you, can you show this TV, the screen? Can you show the screen, please? Right, this is, uh, oh, that's Volvon, so he's awesome. This is uh, Saren, she's like a toxic warframe. Uh, she has like poison and dissolved and acidic attacks. And you can see how the casts for those work. All the particles skew up, they follow some cool vortex field where all the particles are attached, and then they land in the environment and they stay, which is uh, absolutely fantastic. And we have exploding barrels in the game, and I remember when we first got the Apex stuff, we, we put the, remember you're laughing, that's laughing, because we put the exploding barrel in, and the, uh, our effects guy put one million particles when every exploding barrel exploded, and like, yeah, yeah, see all that stuff? That's, oh, that's so rad. And so, uh, we had one million exploding particles, and he had that on that too, and it was just a screen still that they couldn't even play the game. And, the, and the Jeremy's like, and he's going to think this is rock. And then I'm like, and our players are going to kill us because they cannot see anything. So we actually had to kind of strike a balance because uh, the, the particle systems and the turbulence is so fast and they handle so much that we have to kind of strike it. Oh yeah, look at that guy. It totally dissolved into wicked apex particles. Uh, so we've had to kind of be careful showing it too much and probably players' noses in it too much. Um, but true stories happen a lot on uh, the Warframe forums because we have players who uh, don't have NVIDIA uh, and we get support tickets from them all the time. Uh, class A high priority bug, I can't turn on the NVIDIA only Apex effects, uh, when are you gonna, when you gonna give this to me? And we say, well, you have to have this card, to, uh, these series of cards to do it. Um, so it's a big draw for our players and we always see tons and tons of YouTube uh, Warframe. That's kind of how the game is spread kind of grassroots. And you get always the comments, dude, what are you playing this on? My, what, what are all those particles? Where are they coming from? And then, of course, the, the threads before they uh, the, you know, go into the horrible, uh, toxic speak like the internet always does. People will recommend the uh, NVIDIA graphics card to, to see Warframe at its absolute finest.